going guys, Brian here, and we are back with another video, and right now we are going to play The Walking Dead Final Season. So, the, the game just released today, and, yeah, and I want to record with you guys. I haven't played this game, I mean, I played the demo with you guys in the PS4, but then somehow, in my country, the PS4 version doesn't release yet. It's gonna release tomorrow, but then I don't have time, so I want to record with you guys. So yeah, so let's record, let's play The Walking Dead season G now. Alright. Okay, hold on a second. I can't get my just camera just, you know, lag for a while. Oh, that is super lucky for my computer. Episode, episode one. Done running. There it is. Isn't there like there should be something, right? Cause I heard, I heard there's like a story builder. started walking. I was small and alone. That's the season one, Until right? a man named Lee became my protector. Not the season one. Did you have to tell you guys? Uh, I actually played season one and season two. Lee and protected other I did not people record too. that. I did not record. But he couldn't save everyone. I didn't record uh, season one, season two with you guys, so I'm gonna tell you my choices. In season one, we we had to either save Doug or save Carly. I chose to save Carly, and Doug Never dies. Save everyone. Yeah. The living were just as dangerous as the dead. Oh yeah, and then a woman that's in our Lily. group named Lily lost yeah. her dad, and then she just couldn't cope. Yeah, and then she shot Carly. There you go. She took the life. That Lee saved. So, in this part, we have to either choose to let her stay with us or we just left her behind. Instead, we just leave her behind. Lee left her on the side of the road. Lee taught me how to survive. He oh, protected yeah. me as long as he could. Yeah, and then he got bit. But he got bit. Yeah, he got Because bit. of me. And even in the end, he was still teaching. So there, there we have three choices for for Lee to give to Clementine. Uh, we always have the, there are three like three choices basically, and I chose to always keep moving. And always keep moving as much as you can. Move. Lee wouldn't make it. He knew it was the end. He made one final request. Yeah. Either to leave him turn or shoot him. I chose to shoot him. He asked me to shoot him. I actually cried at this part. And I did. I actually cried at this part in uh, I met another group after that. Season Broken there, there people season two. running from their past. There was a woman who gave birth to a boy named Alvin Jr. Yeah. AJ. AJ, yeah, there you he go. He made it. But the mom didn't. And I started to take care of him. But then, Jane left AJ in the snow. We thought he was gone forever. That was the last straw for Kenny. And without Lee around, I had to make the call. Yeah. At this, at this part, uh, I actually let Jane die. I don't shot Ken. I don't even shoot Kenny, even though. I kind of think that he actually lost his mind 
if I just let Jane die. And Kenny killed Jane. It turned out AJ was alive. Jane hid him to make a point. Yeah. Knowing what they'd done. So at this point, I either stayed with Kenny or I went on alone. But then, I mean, we had to survive together, right? So at that time, at that point, I choice, I choice, choose. Sorry, guys, I choose to stay with Kenny. I still decided we were better together. Yeah. For AJ's sake. And then but like we, everything else, it guys, wouldn't last. And AJ and I traveled to a new frontier. Here it goes, yeah. I thought we'd found something that worked, but I was wrong again. They took AJ from me. <sighs> Said I was too young to take care of him. And then David. So I just fought for AJ. You, you, you know, you, I fought you, you, back, guys, you guys saw that, But right? I wasn't strong enough. Last season. I searched for a long time. Just when I gave up hope, I found him. We're searching together now for a place we can call home. I'm all AJ has. He's all I have. And I'll protect him with my life. Just like Lee did for me. Season one now. Oh yeah, you, you guys saw this, right? Come on, you guys saw this, like in the first, in the first gameplay powers, the demo. Actually, we don't know how Clementine found AJ, but then I think we like, just found her, just found him anyways. And there's AJ. What you doing there, goofball? Pretend we got bullets. Pretend then we got bullets. Yeah. Well, don't. It's getting on my nerves. I don't like goofball. I'm too big for it. Would you prefer shitbird? <laughs> no. That's mean. You're a shitbird. What's wrong? AJ? Hungry. I, know, I think some of you guys want to know what happens if we get a toy. So let's give the magazine Here, first. Practice your reading. I guess you guys haven't watched the the demo. But I don't wanna. It'll take your mind off your stomach. Free heat. Free heat. Oven. Place cream, vanilla be beans, into a saucepan and bring to a boy. Uh, yeah. on second thought, never mind. That's only gonna make you hungrier. True. Now let's try if we give the toy. Hey there, Alvin Jr. It's me, Disco Broccoli. Word on the street is that you want to eat me. Is that true? Do you want to eat me? Oh my God. <laughs> Come on, Clem, I can't eat a toy. Oh man, my feelings are hurt. My stomach hurts. <laughs> Sassy. Because because the toy is the broccoli and yeah, it's food. So it's just, Here you go. Just keep it about all we got. What about you? Go for it. We'll find something else soon. I believe you.
We gonna do it? Think so. Looks clear. We're doing it. Water too. All right, let's find some food. Friendly, ring the bell. What does it mean? It means the people here. Shoot first. Let's just ring the bell, man. Let's just ring the bell. We don't give a crap, man. Ring the bell. What are you doing? There's the walker. Now I know what happened to the to their group. I know what happened to their group. Stay back. Oh, man. Feels great. It's down. Still with me? Still here. No bites. Next, we get in there. Monster trap? <laughs> it's not a trap. You swing on it. For fun? <laughs> you get in the tire and someone pushes you so that you go really high. Oh, I wanna try. After we clear this place. That's what I like about this kid, man. Like, because and the other kids, like, they always was like, I wanna try, man, I wanna, I wanna, I wanna try. While well, there's like walkers everywhere, you know. Hmm, interesting. Possible hood ornament. I, I know you guys saw that in the demo. Come on, man. And you can customize your car. You can customize your car, man. It would be so great. You can actually customize your car. Okay. I guess we're wondering what happens if we drink the water in the barrel. I guess we're wondering what happens if we drink the water in the barrel. I mean, it looks like crap, to be honest. So I think I'm gonna drink the barrel. Drink the water. Drink the barrel. What the fuck? <laughs> okay. Whoever used to grow things here is long gone. Yeah. Hold on. There we go. What do we do inside a new place? 
We listen for monsters. After that? Uh... Come on, you remember. We... Inside a new place? Check the windows. Check, check the, windows. the windows. That's right. are all boarded up. This one's locked. Security door. Hmm. Can't pry that open. I know you're hungry. I am too. We'll find something. I promise. Check the walkers. There's a key right there. This opens the lock. <sighs> That's not happening. Please leave us alone. This is what we wanted. That he killed himself. Because they want to leave this world again. Poison. Did they give up? They wanted to leave this world together, holding hands in their own home. Will we have a home? We'll see. Do we get the key? Mm, it's risky. Might be another way through that door. Let's look around. Let's be smart. That's right. I don't think there's any food outside, so let's try the water fountain. And nope, nothing. Water? It wouldn't be that easy, would it? No water. They ate well for their last meal. Yeah, I think everyone died in here. Homemade. There might be more where this came from. A jar of beans. Yeah, it sounds promising. Too small to crawl through. Well, for me. The key or the window. Those are our options. It's dark in there. We should kill the monsters. They're not people. Well, they used to be people. And as people, they asked to be left alone. So what's best? You guys know what choice I made in this part in the demo, because we want to show AJ that we're kind of loyal to the people, but that we have hope for the people. And we don't want to, but at the same time, we don't want to, you know, risk AJ's life for it. But then, anyway, we're gonna send AJ AJ, inside. I need your help on this one. In there? We need to know if there's food inside. You to be brave. Okay, I can be brave. Lift me up. Once you're through, unlock this door. Got it. Got 
thing going here. Can we stay here? We'll see. No one's here. No one's ever anywhere. It's always just monsters. I'm here, kiddo. I know. Are you saying I'm not someone? That's not what I mean. Just it a is few. a great shot. Remember what we said? Always aim for the head. You know this. Always, Always aim for the head. That's right. Come on, let's keep looking. There's gotta be something we can eat. Hope so. If you guys watched the trailer, uh, this is what they were referring to. And when they were, when Clementine was fishing. Is what they were referring to. Not the worst place to sleep. It's spoiled. <sighs> spoiled. Mm -hmm. Sorry, buddy. These are long gone. Fuck. Yo, man, just watch the swears. I don't want to swear a lot now, man. Hey, watch the swears. Yeah, man. Well, you said shitbird before. As I say, not as I do. Yeah. Look. Huh. Something under here. Floor door? Huh, yeah. Have wanted to hide something. Come on, spam Q. Okay. That's a lot of stuff. Yeah, it is. We could eat for weeks with this much. It's a grenade. <laughs> Fuck. It's rigged. AJ! Uh oh, we got some walkers incoming. Oh. 
Okay, we're we're safe. We're safe for now. Come on, shift the gear and then uh, release the handbrake. Give me the knife, give me the knife, bitch, give me the knife. Oh no. Jeez. Screw you, man. Oh no. Get your hands off me. Uh, oh no. Turn, turn, turn. What a what an intro. Wow, what an intro, man. the frontier right I mean to what I heard the the Garcias are not coming to are not going to the to the final season you have a medics uh oh, med kit where the hell am I yeah where the hell am I? Are we? Uh, 
got some photo album that we don't know who it is. Oh, North Lock. Shit. Ah, oh, great. The door is locked, so how can we escape? Open closet. <laughs> what we got in here? Some clothes? What is that? Toolbox. But then we can't reach it. Oh, crap. <laughs> yeah, we can't reach it. Crap. We need a chair. At least a chair. We found one chair, right? Yeah, there it is. This will do. Okay. So we can open the door now, right? I guess we can open the door now. We have consequences to open this door. Is there anything we have consequences? No, that's the only thing. Okay. It's also locked. It's also locked. What's going on here, man? Keeping prisoner or something? Jesus. Sure did work. This thing's also locked. Okay. The hill. We check outside? No. You got a gun, okay, crap. We're not gonna hurt you. Got oh, your so boy, he's safe. It's not a gun, he's just a boy. see him again. You drop that knife. Now. I'm not fucking around. Let him go. Or I let go. I woke up in a locked room with duct tape around my wrists. Why the hell should I trust you? Yeah. I'll let this little standoff slide. But you only get one strike. Now, you're gonna behave so I can take you to see your boy? Because if you really want to fight, you're a little outnumbered. Hey, Jay's okay? Take me to him, now. Jesus. You don't bend, do you? All right. Since you asked so nicely. Sorry about... Locking the door and tying you to the bed and all. You were in uh, pretty rough shape when we found you. You had to take precautions, you know, just in case. But you're safe now, and so is your friend. I'm Marlin, that's Tennessee, but uh, call him Ten for short. He's one bit taking care of you. He uh, doesn't talk much. Clementine. Come on, 
Let's go see your boy. So, Baron. Way to start the game. Why do you have to lock us up? Where are we? So you've been surviving out there a while, huh? Yeah, we've been on the road a long time. Take it you know how to handle yourself? I usually see people our age alone out in the wild. I can't imagine what that must have been like. You sound surprised. I'm like, you think I can't handle myself. No, 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 not at all. Sorry, didn't mean to come off that way. Honestly, I think it's pretty cool. What is this place, anyway? Tell me at least what this place, what this place is. What is that? Oh. It's good we found you when we did. It wasn't easy getting you two out of that wreck. Walkers were on the way. The car, was it totaled? Yeah. Oh. Fuck. Oh, great. I had to work fast. I don't know what would have happened if we hadn't seen the smoke. Oh. I appreciate it. All alone with the kid? Not a pleasant thought. I've seen some rough scenes. Uh, hi there. Uh, hi there? What's going on? What's, What's his problem? problem? You're just new. We haven't seen anything like you in... ever. What is this place? Yeah, well, yeah, you can probably tell it us. used to yeah. be a school. Now it's whatever we want it to be. And who's in charge? Uh, well... I am. Probably sounds strange, kids run by a kid, but we do all right for ourselves. We've got good walls, good defenses, and good location too. No one really comes out this way anymore. We carved ourselves the perfect adult. camp. Kids are safe here. We make sure of it. No adults, at all. It wasn't always like this though. People leave, they die. There's less of us all around. Yeah. I got us a system in place that works well enough. Allow me to make it formal. Welcome to Erickson's boarding school for troubled youth. You and your boy feels like you both fit that description. <laughs> it's hard to survive too long these days uh, without being a bit troubled. AJ and Aaron. You got me and AJ all wrong, Marlin. A couple of pure angels. <laughs> Jury's still out on you, but an angel your boy is decidedly not. It's been a little terror since he arrived. Excuse me? Well, let's just say he hasn't been happy without you around. At all. Oh. Yo! Marlin! We got walkers on the fence! Shit. I need to take care of this. Knowing Willie, it's probably two grandma walkers and an angry squirrel. You got bigger fish. The kid's inside. I think he's with Lewis. Lewis? Oh, right. Uh, just listen for the music. You'll find him. Oh. Get a move on, Willie! Where's your damn weapon? Huh. Guess we'll go inside, I guess. Follow the music. Check. <laughs> Cause I got extra music. That guy again? Oh my god. Like, I need to take my other earphones because I can't hear anything. Okay. I think it is upstairs. Hmm, nope. Music no. sounds like it's coming from this floor. Oh. Dance on the left. Ah, 
Jesus. Hey! hey. Oh. Uh, that time you woke up, huh? your little boy just bit me. Huh? He's lucky I didn't take a boot to his head. Nearly took a chunk out of me. God, it hurts him fierce. Oh, just keep quiet. Ain't you got nothing to say for yourself? Now I see where you learned it from. Maybe you'll have something to say when it's your arm getting bit. Jesus Christ, man. Relax. Fucking hell, man. There it is. afraid you were ticklish. I'm okay. And you know what you are? What? Ticklish. <laughs> but AJ, listen to me. That girl out there says you bit her. Is that true? I'm sure she didn't mean to scare you. I'm sorry, AJ. She snuck up on me. I didn't want to hurt her. I know you didn't, but no more bites, okay? No more bites. You're not dead. That's good. No. Watch your kid for you. What's up, man? My name is AJ. Excuse me. I watched AJ for you. Hope he didn't cause you any trouble. He was a bit of a handful. But I got off light compared to what Ruby went through. AJ doesn't like people coming up behind him. Don't ever do it. Loud and clear, little man. Thankfully, I was here to calm him down with my alluring music. I'm Lewis. Uh, yeah, right, Clementine. Lewis. Oh, yeah. Totally forgot. Marlon left your bag in here somewhere. Don't yeah. worry, I've got it. Oh, let's look at the night. We got the hab. Nice. There's your um Double, um, does he know what that is? It's dirty. Clean it. Maybe later. Back you go. Where it belongs. <clears throat> Dude, that can't be a good idea. That thing's bigger than him. Is it actually loaded? Yes. <laughs> oh, good. I'll guarantee he's a better shot than you. Hey. <laughs> you guys do your thing, I guess. I love how it's like. You don't know so any awkward. others? Well, there is one. But you're armed. What? Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling. Oh, my darling Clementine. You are lost. Oh, my God. And gone forever. Dreadful sorry, Clementine. Light she was and like a fairy, and her shoes were number nine. Herring boxes without topses, sandals were for Clementine. <laughs> what do you think, AJ? I don't know. It's loud. It is. Loud is bad. Not always. Compress this key. Come on. This one right here. Go ahead, AJ. Press it. Now press this one. And this one. <laughs> You're a natural. Hey. Yo, what's up, man? You seen Rosie? Nope. Shit. Whoa. Got a bit of a situation out there. 
Um, to ask you just coming to and all, but could really use a hand. You up for taking out a few deadheads? Oh, great. You Some too, Walker. Lewis. Get your ass in gear. Some Walker <sighs> problems, huh? Fine. We got some Walker problems now. I kinda like Lewis though. He's kinda cool. <laughs> hey Rosie! Where the hell is she? You give her her weapon back? Good. We're gonna need you to put it to use. We've got a hunting party out there trying to get back inside. We need our help to clear the way. It seems to be a few more than usual these last couple days. It's almost like something drew their attention. Something like, I don't know, an explosion or a car crash. Jeez. What? Just saying. There's got to be some explanation. Look, I didn't know any of that was going to happen. Sorry if it caused you guys problems. Uh, um. Hello, Clementine. I'm Violet. Nice to meet you. What he said. All right, boys and girls. They're starting to fill in. Come on. Be careful out there. Don't mind Violet. She, uh, grows on you. I promise. <laughs> That's your oh, weapon. This? It's a chair leg. I call it Cheryl's. Oh my. Why? Clay, let me help. I need you to watch my back. Call out from inside if you see anything. Cool? Okay. Yeah, you, you gotta watch. See you on the other side. Clem, monster. Yeah, I see it. There's two, two walkers. You're dead as well. Okay. Now uh, time to cut the rope, cut the rope. And you're dead, yep. There you go. Looks like they made it back in one piece. What Come the on. hell? Meet him halfway. That's them with a freaking flame. Ooh! <laughs> <laughs> nice! The combat is way better than the than the older games. The older games you have to press like you have to press every single button. And this one like you have to maneuver, you know. Yo, over here. Nice timing. We're not gonna be able to hold them off much longer. No kidding. Where'd all these walkers come from? We can talk when we're back inside the gates. Keep an eye out for stragglers. You know, you're not half bad considering the circumstances and all. Thanks. She's Let's being sarcastic. These guys I off. Think. We don't need them attracting more walkers back at the school. Oh, sup, bro? Who are you, man? Behind you, behind you! <sighs> you gotta watch your back, man. Ow. Don't slap me. Don't you just slap me.
dog. Jeez. Good uh, girl. Oh. Hey, hey. It's all right, girl. It's all right. Hey, I see you and Rosie are making friends. Huh? Had a bad experience with the dog once. Yeah. Well, Rosie here can help you get over it. She's as cuddly as they come. Oh, except when she's mauling walkers, that is. Damn. That walker came out of nowhere. All right, all right, fun's over. Let's get inside. Ah, fucking starving. You're not the only one. <laughs> How'd it go out there? How do you think it went? Be nice, Asim. The safe stone's nearly dry. I could barely find enough for tonight. We're gonna have to scout out further if we want food for the winter. We'll talk about it later. Bullshit. We should talk about this right now. I said later, damn it. Still standing, I see. I'd call that a B plus performance there, Vi. You've done better. Fuck off. <laughs> B minus then. Now, Clem here. That was a solid A. A plus even. Don't be jealous, Vi. Be better. Um, you kicked ass, Violet. A plus. I know. You're both delusional. Violet looks like she's not in the mood for some reason. I don't know. The Lewis man, Jesus Christ. I love that man. <laughs> Fucking hell. They're pretty good with the monsters. Yeah, huh? Come on, y'all. Food's good. Yeah. AJ! <sighs> I'm so sorry about that. It, it happens sometimes. Hm. He's jumpy, little guy. You gonna be okay? He can't go around punching people into... I don't want to expect him to eat at the same table. <laughs> I'll talk to him. Hey. Hey. What are you looking at? What's that bird doing? Well, that's gross. He should stop. Oh, the same thing we're doing. Surviving. But we don't eat monsters. Yeah, but if we could, we probably would. I wouldn't. Whatever you say. I wouldn't. Gross. I didn't mean to hit him. I didn't know that it was Marvin. Marlin. Right. AJ, I'm sure they'll forgive you, but we should go talk to them. But... but I don't think they like me. I can just tell. They don't. Hmm. If they don't, let's go show them how wrong they are. I think I'll stay here. With the bird. Come on. AJ, listen. Come on, AJ. We haven't eaten for days. The car is gone. All that's outside these walls are walkers. Do you really want to go back out there? No. Exactly. So, so we should apologize to Marlin. Right now? Well, we can work up to it. Let's talk to the other kids first. Okay. Help AJ make friends. Oh, God. Okay. I guess we'll talk to whoever... Okay, this the bitch. There's that girl I bet. Yeah, wanna talk to her? You mean say I'm sorry? Yes. She's scary and always seems so mad. You can do it. You just gotta Tell her why you did it. Because of my... thing? Yep. It's nothing to be ashamed of. Just be honest. Yes? 
I'm sorry I bit you sometimes. When I get scared, I do that, but I don't mean to. I just, I just get scared, and I'm sorry, and I hope your finger is okay. Oh, Shug, it's all right. We can all get a little crazy when we get scared. Thank you for your honesty and your apology. I did it. You sure did. Let's go help AJ make some other friends. Those two over there. Lois and yes, I'm ready. Friend. Hey guys. Clem, AJ, this is Omar. Omar. Uh, excuse me. Chef Omar. Hello, and no, it's not ready yet. Omar's a perfectionist. The slightest flavor out of place, and he's grumpy for a week. You can eat, or you can eat right. All it'll cost you is a little patience. I'll let you guys know when we're done. What's up, Omar? How are you, Omar? Now we're gonna find some other friends. Uh, these two. Violet. Is that Violet? No, it's not Violet. Marlon and a friend. I'm not ready. Not yet. Okay. okay Let's fine. talk to someone else. I guess we're gonna look for someone else. Where is Violet? Those three, those two over there, three, what the fuck? Hey guys. Hang on. Knock it off, Ten. Heard you guys didn't have the best introduction. It wasn't my fault. Ten. I really am sorry, really. I'm sorry too. What is this? Our graveyard. You guys still do that? Kinda, sorta. So, who was buried here? Nobody, really. This is where we buried ten sisters' belongings. Minnie and Sophie. Twins. Lost in. Both about a year ago. Yeah. Paying respects. Should we do that too? Maybe. I've never seen anyone do that. Yeah. I think that'd be a very nice thing to do, AJ. Come on. Thank you. Clementine, right? Yep. A sim, right? What are you writing? What happened today? I chronicle everything. Hmm. Like a diary? I try to think of it more like a history book. Those who do not learn from the past and all that. <sighs> you seemed really mad at Marlin back there. He keeps pulling back the safe zone. We have fewer and fewer places to hunt. Which means we're gonna have fewer and fewer things to eat. The new girl went and helped the... Hun hunting party come back. She. Hey, zip it! Whoa. That is not yours to read, kid. Give it back. It was just sitting there. So? So it was just sitting there. Uh, <sighs> not cool. This thing is the only place I get any real privacy around here. I gotta finish this before dinner. Not to be, like, rude, but, you know. Bye. Jesus Christ, man. He, he just... Clem? Yeah? I'm ready. Okay. To talk to Marlon. Okay. Then, we, then we'll talk to Marlon. We'll talk to Marlon then. Here we go. Clementine, right? I'm Brody. He's a sweet little fella. 
Figured there ain't a lot of room for sweetness still out there. I'm the lucky one. He's just naturally good. Naturally good? That's rare stuff. I'm really sorry I hit you. Can we please stay here and eat dinner and not go out into the forest and get killed by monsters? Don't sweat it, buddy. You can make it up to me by teaching me your technique. You, a regular heavyweight. Hey, Clem! AJ! Stew's done! Hey. Time to eat some food now, man. You guys earn your supper after all. Thank you very much, Marlon. Is served. <laughs> Thanks. Wow, can't remember the last time we had a hot meal. Mm, this is really good. Oh, <laughs> Jesus Christ. Oh, come on. <laughs> oh. they shared as much as they could. AJ, heads up. I'm full, kiddo. You can have the rest. Are you sure? You bet. All right, then. <sighs> well done. Whoa. <laughs> mm-hmm. Me too. Now what? I'll tell you what. Time for something very important. Oh, God. Good night. Wow. Violet, man. it's time. Really? What's the game tonight, Lou? War. The oldest game around. A game played by man and beast alike. The only game there is. Get ready, losers, because it's time for you all to lose. Oh, shit. I like that. Yeah. Oh, talk. Uh-uh. Yeah. True talk. Ooh. It's easy. Everyone gets a stack of cards. Everyone flips one over. Highest card wins. And the winner gets to ask Clem a question. What? I want to get to know you. We all do. All right. What if I win? Then you get to ask us one. It's only fair. All right. Oh, wait, what about AJ? Oh, where is AJ? What about him? <laughs> Looks like he's made a friend. Oh, he's right there. You can take your eyes off him for one card game. But you both could use a break from each other. Yeah, maybe. This is his first time around anyone his own age. Sometimes he acts more like an adult than a kid. It's nice to see him act like a little boy again. Lewis, if you would. Damn, Violet, ask me a question now. Way to go, me. So, about AJ. Uh-huh, how about AJ? Where are AJ's parents? Oh. You two don't really look related, so... What happened there? They're dead. They were nice people. For the most part. It makes sense. He's a nice kid. For the most part. I turn. win. Hey, you do. Yeah. So, what do you want to know? Uh. <laughs> you guys meet anyone famous out there? No. Too bad. You'd figure a movie star or something would show up somewhere. 
They had like millions of dollars. They're probably living in a bunker with butlers and waterbeds out the ass. Yeah, maybe. I met a guy who used to be a baseball player. Like, for money. Oh. That's cool. Here. I used to love baseball. That's that's was he good at it? Dunno. We never got to play. He was good with a bat though. Yeah, that's baseball heavy. sucks. You suck. Not as much as baseball. Ooh. Whoa. Damn. Okay, I got ten. Booyah! Good. Oh, damn it, man. Damn it. Got the question now. Come on, spit it out. So, uh, ever, uh, ever have a boyfriend? Ooh. Oh my god. <laughs> well, it happened. Perfectly valid question. You can ask me if I've ever had a girlfriend. I haven't. By the way, oh, I'm sure she's oh, real the, surprised about that yeah. one. I met a boy one time, and and we were friends, <laughs> just friends. <laughs> Nothing else. Uh, Nothing at all. He was a huge dork. Yeah, just that, just friends. Hmm. Uh, okay. Ha! <laughs> uh, I win. So, clap. Uh -uh. Can't have been alone this entire time. Who used to take care of you? Oh, family? Me, uh... Anyone? <sighs> the first person who taught me about survival was Lee. <laughs> What'd he teach you? Lots of stuff. Most important thing? How to use it, how to let go. How to say goodbye. I win again. Yeah. You do indeed. Ask away. Okay, next question. Grossest okay, thing. Uh, ever. What's grossest the thing? grossest thing you've ever eaten? It's pretty easy. Uh, horse eyeballs. Slugs. Cantaloupe. Come on. Dude, I fucking hate cantaloupe. I ate a guy's leg once. Ooh, jeez. I'm kidding. <laughs> Are you? Uh -oh. Victory Violet. Here's something I love to ask when I'm in groups. <clears throat> Out of the four of us, who do you think is gonna die first? That is fucked up. <laughs> oh, I know. Anyone but me. Any one of you, but certainly not me. So sure. Made it this far. So have we. I am the greatest card player of all time. Just ask your damn question. <laughs> Ever? Actually, never mind. What? Ask it. It's not a fun question. Ask. Ever had to kill someone you loved? Oh, no. Lewis. Hey! She wanted me to ask. Lee. His name was Lee. It was the same day I found out my parents were dead. That... sounds like a rough day. <sighs> yeah. Worst day of my life. I think I'm done playing for tonight. Yeah. It's probably for the best. You wanted me to ask. Let's go, AJ. Uh, good night. Night, AJ. Hey, long day, huh? Yep, real long. Uh, I hope you know Lewis didn't mean any harm there. He's just the world's biggest dumbass. Yeah, he's my best friend, so I can legally call him that. So, guys, relax. Get some sleep. I'm human for a night. In the morning, come find me. We can talk about making this long term. We can stay? We can talk about it. Ooh. Hope we can at least stay, man. I kind of like you guys. Somehow, you guys are cool, you know. Oh no.
That looks like a really safe window. It does. <laughs> Good. This box has so many colors. Well, must have been an artist living in here. What's an artist? It's like a person who colors a lot, draws, does pictures. You mean like tin? Yeah, like tin. Huh. I like to do pictures too. Oh, shit. I, I didn't know Marlon set you up in this room. I just wanted to grab something from the closet. Where the hell is it? This is it. Oh, uh, what? That's what I was looking for. It belonged to Sophie. Oh. Uh, Ten sister. He was asking for more art supplies and stuff, so I was going to. Oh, sorry. We didn't know. No, no. It's it's fine. Don't don't worry about it. Honestly, it's just been sitting here for the past year and no one's touched it. If AJ wants to play with it, it's it's fine. You should probably give the box back. It doesn't belong to us. Thanks, buddy. It's just that Ten wanted it since it was his sister's and all. It's okay. You can finish your drawing, though. I don't mind. Huh. I see you're, um, settling in. Yeah, is that okay? Sure. I guess. I always liked this room. Sophie had, like, paintings and shit on the walls. Lots of color. And Minerva. She was really musical. Not like Lewis, though. She had actual talent. <laughs> she had the most amazing voice. Real bluesy. Marlon always joked that he would scavenge a guitar and the two of them would tour the country. That was a long time ago. After they... Afterwards, Brody and Ten took down all the paintings, and that was the end of it. I shouldn't have even brought it up. It's not a good memory. Guess I just lost my train of thought. Oh, they sound like they were great friends. Yeah, Sophie was a good friend. And Minnie... Uh, we were close. Me and her. What exactly happened to them? Sophie and Minerva. They went scavenging with Marlon and Brody out past the safe zone. Didn't make it back. It happens. So he got bit, I guess. Honestly, I just miss having someone around to talk to. There's just so many dudes. This place can get a little too bro town for my liking sometimes. And I'm not exactly, like, a people person, you know? Oh, I know explains. I sometimes have a habit, have a habit of being a little bit too harsh. You come off all right. I thought you were pretty cool. Oh, um, thanks, I guess. You were pretty cool, too, out there against those walkers. Hey, Clem, I'm an artist now. Not bad, kiddo. I should be getting back. Thanks again for the box. You're pretty cool, AJ. See ya. Yeah, see ya. <sighs> okay, Alvin Jr., time for bed. Okay, here. For me? For the wall, to make our home look nice. That's a good idea, AJ. Shite. How about here? Uh, collectibles can be found in the world to decorate your home. Uh, AJ?
Hey there. What are you doing? This is where I'm gonna sleep. <laughs> what? No, it's not. It's safe under here. No one can get me. Come on, AJ. The bed is way better. Oh, man. This bed is so comfy. <laughs> what about the door? What if someone comes in? What if they try to hurt us? What if they steal our stuff? I'll keep watch. I'll sleep with one eye open if I have to. You can't sleep like that. I tried. If I stay here, no one can find me, and I can keep guard and watch over you. I can protect us. <sighs> hey, what's gotten into you? Please, Clem. It's not so bad down here. All I'll right. be okay, I promise. All right. Okay, okay, you can sleep under the bed. Here, for your head. Let me know if you get cold. I will. Okay. Good night, AJ. Clem? Yeah? I'm glad we're not sleeping in the car anymore. Yeah. Me too. Stay, right? I, I guess we're gonna find out. Let's find his office. I know where it is. I'll show you. Oh, somehow you know. <laughs> Up here. Come on, Clem, this way. Hey, AJ, wait up. Tintu. Hey, Clem. Thanks for the pencils. I missed having colors. Sure thing. Who are these guys? They're firefighters. That one's a policeman. She's gonna save the day. But what are they? They... These are the people who protected us. Where are they? I've never seen one before. They all died a long time ago, trying to save everyone. Oh, they were weak. What? No, they were brave, strong. Now, give it to me and... No, he's mine now. Hey, give it back. No. You don't even know what they are. Okay, okay, that's enough, you two. It's not yours anymore. Clem, please. It's mine. No, it's not. Oh, fine. Thanks. Do you know where Marlon is? I don't know. He should be around. I can go find him. That'd be nice. Thanks, Ten. Look! Hey, what'd you find? It's a picture of Marlon and Lewis. They're so little. Wow, they've known each other a long time, huh? Marlon? Oh, Jesus. Uh, uh, uh. Stay back. Dead dogs brought back bad memories. I'm sorry. I didn't realize you were so scared. But I swear, Rosie's not as frightening as she seems. <laughs> Sit, girl. 
See? She's harmless. She just needs to get to know you is all. Here. I'll show you. Do you trust me? Rosie. Shh. Sorry. I promise she's not gonna bite. <sighs> okay. I guess. Get down at her level. Better get your scent. It's okay. She's not gonna hurt you. There you go. Now whistle and tell her to lie down. Lie down, Rosie. Rosie will recognize you. She's really well trained. She was the headmaster's dog back when this place was still functional. Mm. But when the world went to shit, he bailed. All the other adults did. Left us behind to fend for ourselves. Oh, well, what a dick. So they were. Understatement of the century. Now it's just us kids left. And I'd like it if you and AJ were part of that. Both of you are plenty capable, and we need that. Here. This is the current state of our plan for gathering food. We are starting to run short. It's getting harder and harder to feed everyone in this school. What's the trap area? The hunting grounds, more or less. Lewis built some traps out there to catch game. He and a Sam are set to go check them today. The greenhouse? Oh, yeah. Well, don't get too excited about that one. We used to maintain it real well. Had plenty of vegetables growing. But it became overgrown. Upkeep was impossible. Yeah, we, uh, we keep away from that now. I didn't realize how much forest surrounds this place. It's how we've kept ourselves from unwanted attention for so long. Well, for the most part, anyway. That's the only road that leads in and out of Ericsson. If you go off it, you'll eventually end up in the valley. We used to have signs that led people to the school, but I took them down. I wanted this place to be hard to find. What's out here? Oh, that's where we fish. I got a shack for storage right here, right along the river. It's secure, mostly. You get the occasional walker or two come by. Vine Brody should be heading out there in a bit. That's the train station. There was a whole stash of food under the floorboards. Oh, where you crashed your car? Pretty sure that place a lost cause. There's a hell of a lot of smoke coming from it when we found you two. Walkers flooded in there after all the noise you made. One more thing. See these red lights? Yeah. So everything inside is the safe zone. It's been getting smaller over the years, and the food's become more scarce. So, why not go outside it? <laughs> I can't. Whenever someone goes outside the safe zone, bad shit happens. People die or disappear. I just... <clears throat> I could really use the help, Clementine. Taking care of these kids, it's not easy. I'm worried that if I don't figure something out, if, if I don't fix our food situation, I can't lose anyone else. Well, okay. We've already lost so much. Friends, siblings, I can't let another kid die. It could break us. We're not gonna let that happen. I promise. <sighs> Thanks, Clementine. I appreciate that. I really do. Everyone's counting on me to step up. Be the leader they need me to be. I really want to be that for them. You and AJ are two more mouths to feed. Maybe you can help me feed the rest. So what do you need from us? Lewis and Asim are heading to the hunting grounds, looking for rabbits. Well, Asim will, anyway. Lewis, I uh, just hope he shows up, if I'm really being honest. Violet and Brody are going up river to do some spear fishing. And hopefully, those two get along long enough to get some work done. 
Both mm. teams could use some extra hands. Oh god. I'm gonna have to choose which one to help first. We're gonna... Uh... Help the girls or help the boys? Hmm. Let's go help the girls. We're gonna go fishing. Okay. Take this. I don't want you getting lost. Thanks. We need all hands on deck if we're gonna find any more food. Just remember to stay in the safe zone. We need you to come back home in one piece. So that means we can stay? What? Do you think I was gonna throw you out? Maybe. Well, as long as we got enough to eat. We're both welcome here. Nice. Go get him, AJ. All right, let's get going. See you around. Now we're gonna help the girls because since they don't, those two don't like get along well to get the job done, we're gonna help them. But the boys, well, they can do it for You know, later. I've been thinking. I wish we could all go on a road trip together. Road trip? Why bother? It's not like there's anything worth seeing anymore. Oh, come on. I'm sure there's plenty of stuff to see. Maybe Clem could show us around. You're able to get a car working, and you know how to drive? Barely. Come on, bye. I've never driven in my life, but I'd love to learn. Are you sure you trust my driving? I promise I don't usually crash. <laughs> oh, right. On second thought. Yeah, I think Clem just totaled the last working car in the world. So much for your road trip. <laughs> Are we going to the car? No, bud. It's broken. Good. I'm sick of the car. I wish this old rust bucket was still working. We could just jump in and start driving. We could take turns sitting in the back. It'd be like driving one of those cars with the top that goes down. We'd run out of gas eventually. But still, it's fun to imagine, isn't it? <laughs> Where would you go, Clem? If you could drive anywhere you wanted, if gas wasn't an issue. Or a busted carburetor, or flat tires, or the transmission. Buzzkill. I'd drive up one of those long roads that wind around the mountains. Follow it all the way to the top. You could see over the whole world up there, I bet. Yeah. Get a nice view of the world while you die of frostbite. Sounds like the dream. Come on, Vi. Would it kill you to live a little? I've lived here my entire life. Heck, I'd say I know every inch of these woods. I'd kind of like to unknow it. No use dreaming of what could be. We've got shit to do. Yeah, I guess we should get to work on those fish. We got spears inside the shack. Come on. You go ahead. I'll stay out here. Let's hope you not die, Violet. Uh, I mean, even though we're still in the Where are though. those spears? Hey, about Bye. I'm sorry she's being a little mean. It's my fault. What do you mean? I was there when those walkers killed Sophie and Minnie. They were really close with Vi, and I think she blames me for what happened to them. I mean, how do you even apologize for something that fucked up? I don't know. You should talk to her. Maybe I deserve it. You should talk to her about it. I'm sure she'll listen. <laughs> yeah, right. I tried. I have. It just never seems like the right time. We all used to be friends. Guess I just kind of missed that. But when you showed up, I, I don't know. I just haven't seen her warm up to someone in a long time. Oh, there's a Spears. Hmm. <laughs> to ask this of you but do you think you could talk to her see try. how she feels about me 
It's just been eating me up inside. I don't know. I can try, but I can't make any promises that it'll help. Thanks, Clementine. I'm yeah, gonna go I'm check gonna our fish traps downstream. Hey, what the hell is taking you two so long? See? I'll take this to Vi. There should be some extras lying around. Hey, you. What you looking at? V plus M. Oh. Violet and Minerva. What does that mean? Uh, it means they were really good friends. Like me and you are really good friends? Not exactly. <laughs> They're actually, you know, couples, you know? Just some old gardening supplies. Mm-hmm. Where's the final spear? Oh, there's the final spear. Cool. Ready to get some fish? Yeah. Okay, let's go. Join you? Sure. Hey, check out these guys over here. They're swimming against the current. Guess I don't realize it makes them easier targets. I want to try. Take a spear. Go nuts. Go ahead and try. They're not running. Fish. Any luck? I got something. Good enough for me. It looks like a meal. Hey, um, sorry if I was weird last night about the whole room thing. Seeing someone else in there, uh, it was harder than I expected. You'd think I'd be less sentimental by now. <laughs> uh, I understand. There are people I still miss, too. It never really gets easier. Yeah, it really doesn't. I hate her. I just... <clears throat> I wish we could all go on a road trip together. God, she's so... Oh, you know? You can't like everybody. Looks like they wisened up. Maybe Brody had better luck with the traps. I got one! Clem, I got one! <laughs> Good job. <laughs> I don't know what the problem is between us. With Brody. I don't know why it's like this. Why is it so weird? I can never relax around her. It just keeps getting worse. Maybe because she never said sorry about Sophie and Minnie and not being able to save them. Did she tell you that? Hmm, more or less. She wants to talk about it, you know. I just, I feel guilty about the whole thing. Why? I was supposed to be out with the twins that day. I wanted to work in the greenhouse, so I asked Brody to cover for me. But then... I didn't even get to say goodbye. I, I wanted to talk to Brody, to tell her I didn't blame her for what happened, but every time I tried, I was reminded of who we lost. It was easier to just not talk about it. 
We should get going. You guys catch any fish? We caught some, but not a lot. I didn't get anything. We should catch up with Lewis and Asim. See if they had any better luck. The Grand Canyon. What? That's where I'd go. If we took a road trip, start driving until we hit the Grand Canyon. Yeah. That would be cool. Thanks. Hey, you slow folks coming? Yeah, we're right behind you. Where are those guys? Practicing making out with a toothless walker. Gross. I know. Poor walker. <laughs> <laughs> what the hell? What? What? This isn't normal? Someone sabotaged this. This isn't good. Oh. A Sam? Lewis! Spread out. See if we can find them. Watch out for monsters. There's blood. Huh. Cigarette. Is this a Bible page? Flim, found something. What's up? Where's that monster? Walker? Guys, over here! Well, we didn't kill this one. We wouldn't have left it hanging in our trap. What the hell? Found this too. Do any of the kids smoke? Nope. Nothing to smoke. Who is this unlucky fella? What the? Where have you been? Checking nearby traps. The ones that were sprung were all empty. All the rest are broken. Someone robbed us? Oh, great. And now we're gonna starve. <sighs> Fuck. That's... Fuck. Fuck. It's just... Fuck. It's okay. It's... Breathe, Brody. Come on. Come on, come on, come on. You're gonna be fine. It's just a panic attack. Take a second. Breathe in deep. And hold it. Just shut the fuck up, okay? Jesus, Excuse me? Help you, man. I, I have to tell Marlon about this. Um, we still need food. You know, to live. We definitely don't have enough here. You guys figure it out. I'll take this haul back to school. And maybe we can ration out something. So what do we do? Eat rocks? You can't eat rocks. I'm aware. <laughs> Will Marlon kick us out if we don't find food? Well, let's not find out. Where else could we look? <sighs> Let me think. We can go to the train station, but that's outside the zone. That's the only place we can go. The train station. It's not too far from here. Maybe, but it's outside the safe zone. Yeah, exactly. There was food in there when AJ and I passed through. It's worth a look. You sure there was food? Positive. Yeah, some of it was destroyed in the explosion, but there has to be something left. There was so much there. Or we could starve. Fine. Let's go. You gotta take the risk. Great. Let's just hope Marlin doesn't get pissed about this. Oh, jeez. That's a lot of walkers. There. That's where the food is. A lot more walkers than last time, though. We're gonna die. It's 
either die here or die from hunger. Take your pick. Clem, maybe you should scope things out. You know the place better. Let me get a closer look. Can't be too careful. I used that bell to attract a walker before. Could try it again. They do like to follow sound. Yeah, but then we're gonna have to enter to here. We barely got out of here. It was close. It sounds scary. There's a reason. Could climb up there, but I don't know how that would get us inside. You look like you've got an idea. The noise from that bell could draw a lot of walkers. If one of us climbs up there and starts ringing it... Lewis. I vote Lewis. <laughs> uh, hold on. I'd like to make an alternate suggestion. Come on, Lou. You're loud, dramatic, a little annoying. You're basically a walking distraction. I think you mean charming and theatrical. Just get up there. The quicker we get this over with, the better. Decisive. I like that in a woman. Just stop. <laughs> stop. I'll go with you. Give you some cover. Fine. I'll do it. But if I die, I'm making sure Walker Lewis eats both of you first. <laughs> I'll distract them until I see you guys reach safe cover. Then, I'll try to redirect the smelly patrol to give you guys a chance to sprint inside the building. When we get into position, I'll signal you. Then you can do your thing. Good luck! Oh, I thought we were going to have to ring the bells like through the thing. You either. Him. Fine. Make it confusing why not you. <laughs> oh Jesus Christ. My E is not working for some reason. Behind me, man, I swear to God. Always a walker behind me. It is gonna take a long time, man. Hey, ugly! No, not you! Not you either! Damn! Fine, make this confusing, why don't you? Sounds good. Let's make it quick. Come on, come on, come on. 
Oh, Jesus. I didn't see you there. No. The couple's still there. Oh, I was going. I saw someone back at the door. I don't know. Must have been the couple's or I'm not sure. Yes, these will be perfect. Clint, look. Try it out. See if it works. It works. Gonna need your help on this one, kiddo. You still got your gun? Just in case. Just in case. AJ, is there more? There's more? Keep it coming. Oh, God. I have a bad feeling about this. Stand. Slowly. Uh oh. Uh... Don't yell. Don't try anything. I won't hurt you. I don't have to. Who are you? The name's Abel. And I'm hungry as hell. So it was you who sabotaged the trap. You and your friends made a lot of noise out there. It wasn't hard to follow. You live close by? You knew about this place already and organized some effort to get inside. So you probably also knew the stash was there. You'll understand if I don't tell you anything. It wasn't really a question. More like confirmation. Questions. I don't like it. Fine. We can play it like that. If you want. Now, I'm gonna fill this pack real slow. We worked hard to get this stuff. <clears throat> well, hey there, Squirt. Playing hide and seek, are we? Now that's impolite. Don't steal from us. I'm not stealing. This isn't yours. I can kill you, you know. Come on, kid. I'm faster than you. Listen up, Squirt. You're gonna quit pointing that gun at me and let me go my Mary. You understand? I'm just gonna take a little bit, then I'm leaving. Like it never happened. Wouldn't let a hungry man starve now, would you? AJ, get down! Die, bitch. You piece of shit! What the fuck? Just take a bag and fill it up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up.
Listening to me, Marlon, listen to me. I am telling you, the place was ransacked. It's fine. We'll deal with it. Took y'all a while. How poor are they that have not patience? A Sim! Mitch! Check it out! Food! That's like a lot of food. Observant as ever, Mitch. I can't believe this. Look at it. You're our savior, Clem. Like, seriously, it's a lot. Hey, I helped too. <laughs> Where did you find all this? The old train station. Clem knew where it was. Train station? That's outside the safe zone. We'd have even more, but we ran into the creep that fucked up our rabbit traps. Creep? What creep? Clem saw him smoking those nasty-ass Bible cigarettes. He had weird, different colored eyes. Hmm? Did he follow you? Nope. I shoved him into a pack of walkers. It took a chunk out of him. It was awesome! Look, I don't know if he got out of there, but if he did, he won't make it for long. You attacked him? What the fuck? If he survived, you know he's coming back for revenge. What, what do you want me to do? What the hell were you thinking? <sighs> this is fucked. How could you be so stupid? If I hadn't done what I did, he would have shot us. I made the right call. Bullshit! What if there are others? You don't know Your what people are capable of out changed. there. What, really? Think again. I, I just can't. I won't. Just not again. Fuck! What the hell's going on here? She took them outside the safe zone. They saw someone. You know what that means! Enough! Just means there's a hungry guy out there looking for food happened before you are overreacting you can't be serious come on let's go somewhere and talk about this if anything happens I'm holding you responsible oh Clem I know I asked you for help you did you did, but... Shit. God, nothing's easy. It was risky, but it was worth it. Like you said, we can't lose another kid. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, I did say that. <clears throat> well, at least we're eating tonight. For the next few, I'd wager. Um, I'll go talk to Brody. Thanks for the haul, Clem. You guys should go enjoy it. You've earned it. Don't sweat it, Clem. Ever since we lost Sophie and Minnie, Brody's been freaked out by anything that happens past the safe zone. She'll be all right eventually. Still, we should make sure this is a one-time thing. We can take Rosie out in the morning, see if she catches a scent. You know, just in case. I'm gonna go clean up. I think I'll go too. See you later. Don't worry about them. They're just sad. Sad? Why? My sisters died around this time last year. I think it's starting to get to people. Doesn't it get to you? Not really. Dying's not scary. I mean, it's sad, but not scary. You've been in here too long. When you see more death, you'll be a lot more afraid of it. Or maybe a lot less. I try not to focus on them being gone. I like picturing where they'd be now, instead. Sophie was awesome at making stuff. 
She'd build a place big enough for all of us to live. And paint it too. And Minnie would be playing whatever new song she wrote. I guess that doesn't scare me because I know I have something waiting on the other side. Someplace safe and happy. All of us together. I don't think there's anything after we die. Just darkness. There might be. You don't know. Nobody knows. But if there is, I think it'd be like this. Who are those guys? The walkers who killed them. You want them there too? They weren't always walkers. Wherever this place is, everyone gets to be a person again. Sometimes I draw the walkers the way they probably looked. Sometimes I draw Minnie and Sophie the way they probably left them. Hmm? But sometimes I draw this too. Can, can I be there? Sure. You want to be there too? I promise I'll draw you well. You just got to hold still. Sure, why not? Oh, I almost forgot. Well, uh, Here you yeah. go. It's yours. It's ours. Ken's got some real talent. It's getting late. Yeah, you guys should get some sleep. Aren't you coming? Not yet. I want to finish this first. Good night. See you tomorrow. Time for bed, little guy. Can I stay up? Nope. Two more minutes. Tell you what, you lay down, and then we'll see. <laughs> you got in bed by yourself. I like it here. I got to kill fish. Violet looked like she was having a good time. It's nice, not driving everywhere or running away. But the ranch was nice, too, before the blood. This isn't the ranch. Do you like it? I like it, now that I'm used to it. There's games, and the walls make it feel safe. It's good, for now. But places change, and so do people. It might not stay good. Don't worry, we're not leaving. There, you gotta stay up two minutes more. Time for sleep. I'll lay down when you blow out the light. All right, give me a minute. You can now place collectives, collectibles in your room. There, that's a good drawing. He's a good artist. Your picture is good too. Oh, I know. <laughs> so cute. So used to lugging this everywhere, never knowing when we'd find any supplies. I feel a lot lighter. Good night, sleep tight, don't let a walker bite. And if they try, I never let them bite. Come on, play it right. One time, bang. <laughs> Good work, and thanks.
What's going on now? Check out the window. What's going on? What the hell? There's voices in the pipes. I think someone's in trouble. Is it us? What's no, 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 not right now. But we should help them. If it's a monster, we should kill it. I don't think it is. You got your gun. Uh-huh. I'll be right back. What's going on? Stay safe. feeling about this. According to the map, there should be another entrance to the basement around here. Can we check the map? Check the map. I mean, grab brick. Heavy. Okay. Now we got ourselves the weapon. Oh, here. You are the I was arguing. Terribly. You don't even know where she 
sure it was there. She also said he got bit. But he ain't gonna bother us. You know he's not alone. Those bastards are back, and it's only a matter of time before they find us. You know that. Oh, shit! Nothing to you! There you go again, getting so mad! What do you want me to do? You're making me mad! Oh, we have to tell the others about what you did! Sam, show yourself! Clem! What are you doing down here, in the dark? Brody and I were just talking. Go get some sleep. You deserve some shut-eye. You had a busy day. I was asleep. You guys woke me up. So sorry about that. I, I didn't think anyone would hear us. You want to tell me what's going on? It's really none of your business. Go back to the dorm. I, uh... Uh... The man you met at the station! We got history. Brody! Don't listen to her, Clint. She's acting crazy. She gets this way sometimes. She's just got to tune it out. Let her speak, asshole. Uh, excuse me? I want to hear what she has to say. How do you know that guy? Marlon let him take the twins. Him and his people. Brody! Ten sisters. I thought they were killed by walkers. That's the story we told everyone. Shut up! Because Marlon was so ashamed Shut of what... Shut up! Jesus. What'd you say? Shit. I'm sorry. Shit! What have you done? I'm so sorry. So, so, so. You're gonna be okay. I, I promise. God damn it! Hell! You said it. I told you not to say it. Please be okay. Get away from her. Come on. Hey, come on. I mean it, Marlin. Step back. Okay. Okay. Just, just stay with her. There, there, there's a first aid kit down here somewhere, right? First aid kit? Brody, it's me, Clem. Just, just stay still. Uh, who? Uh, I, I, I can't see. Clementine, remember? We talked about driving up into the mountains, where you could see everything. really thin. I could force it in there and lift up the latch. I can't find it in this dark. Need a flashlight. Yes, flashlight. That'll help. Oh, God. Where's...
This will work. Oh shit. Bro. We gotta get out of here, man. We gotta get out of here. Oh god, jumps. Shit. Uh oh. Finish her! Come on, come on, come on! Now we know what's going on. Now we know what's up. Where's AJ? Put the gun down. Get this fucking psycho away from me! Where is she? she she's in the basement. She, she murdered Brody. Shut the fuck up. Don't, 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 don't you dare put that on me. Is that blood on your face? You're the one who murdered Brody. Brody. Did you see it happen? Is she a walker now? That's bullshit, Marlin! Clem! You killed Brody. You hit her so hard, her head split open. That's a lie! I saw you kill her! What the hell is going on? Look at her hands! She's covered in Brody's blood! Jesus Christ, Clem. What did you do? get food. What good is food if a group of outsiders just gonna come along and take it? I'm just saying. Man, this is fucked up. We don't know her, y'all. Lewis, don't let him do this. Oh no, I am not involved. 
What? I like you, Clem, but I... Not me. I'm sorry. You're, uh... On your own. I'm sorry. You let him shoot me. Really? Just so you don't have to get involved. I thought you were more than that. Shit. Marlin, come on, man. Drop the gun. Lewis! She killed Brody! We can't let her walk away. I didn't kill Brody, man. Clem, I, I... I gotta trust Marlin. You don't. I just... I gotta. I always have. Brody trusted him. And now she's dead. And he killed her! Take that back! to get them stage some kind of rescue honest Ted I just couldn't I was I was too afraid you killed Brody because she knew <laughs> I didn't mean to I didn't want this I wanted to save all of you Sophie Minerva we can still fix this Marlin it's going to be okay. We can make this right. We'll help you. We're all family here. The only one any of us has left. Come on, brother. Come on. Just drop the gun. Drop the gun. I know I betrayed you. All of you. Just let me leave. You'll never have to see me again. Just let me become a bad memory. Just give me that. Please. Fine.
stay, man. He just changed his mind. He was going soft on them, and then you killed him. Sometimes I don't know where Why? the standing road is taking me. Sometimes I don't know the reason why. So I guess I'll keep gambling lots of moves and lots of rain. You and 24% left 10 feeling resentful. Wait, what? So basically, our relationship towards each character has like a different feeling. Brody did. She cleaned me out and she hit it on the side Well, I tried to kill the pain I bought some wine I have to trade Well, it was easier than just to wait in the round to die You and 42% left Lois feeling lost When you told him about killing a loved one, he sympathized He sympathized with your pain and a friend said he knew where some reason money was. Married was lived. We robbed a man Relief. and brother. To Did we forgive him for his actions towards but the twins and Brody? Caught up with me and he felt proud when you trusted him with those And now it's too long years away. You and 25% left AJ Harden in. AJ was resolved to sleep under the bed after after the first night of school. He was satisfied when he attacked Abel at the street. Oh! So our actions changed their characters' feelings. You and 42% Violet feeling horrible. She was pleased and after you complimented her fighting skills. Violet was fluttered after you comforted and her. Still, in the door. she don't drink or lie. Well, his name is Codeine. He's the nicest thing I've seen. And together, we're going to wait around to die. These are collectibles. That was intense, I guess. Anyway guys, that's it for this video. So thank you guys for watching, subscribe, and I'll see you guys in the next video and peace.